Hey guys, welcome to the Cotton Channel. So today we'll be talking about Mahayana Buddhism. So Mahayana Buddhism is actually the largest group of Buddhism as compared to Theravada Buddhism and also the Tibetan Buddhism. So the difference in Mahayana Buddhism is that Mahayana Buddhism actually focuses on helping others instead of just themselves. So it's more like spreading kindness and spreading wisdom towards other people. So here are some of the key characteristics of Mahayana Buddhism. So like I mentioned before, Mahayana Buddhist focuses a lot on helping other people. They focus on having compassion and helping all the other beings, not just humans, animals as well. And not just themselves, they help others to reach enlightenment, to help others think in a better way. So they look up to Bodhisattva. So Bodhisattva is like Guan Yin. So what a Bodhisattva does is that Bodhisattva are supposed to be a Buddha. They are supposed to enter Nirvana, but they put it on hold just so that they can help other people first. They can help everyone else before they become Buddha. So Mahayana Buddhists actually have a more extended, a more wider range of scriptures as compared to the Theravada Buddhists because they have actually studied even more and to actually extend that knowledge. So this actually helped to provide a new perspective towards Buddhahood. So depending on different regions, they actually have a wide range of different practices. For example, meditations or rituals, and also the belief might be slightly different in different regions as well. So while in Theravada Buddhism, it focuses more on personal enlightenment, Mahayana Buddhism actually focuses more on helping others, having compassion and having kindness. So in conclusion, Mahayana Buddhism focuses on spreading love, spreading kindness, spreading wisdom towards other people and not just themselves. So I hope that you find this video useful and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.